The popularity of social districts in the triad keeps on growing. Lexington city leaders approved an area for people to sip and stroll. Several other cities like Greensboro and High Point have them. WFMY News 2's Amber Lake spoke to a business hoping to cash in. In a town known for its barbecue. Lexington's awesome. New opportunities arise. I think it's going to be very beneficial. I feel like it would be wonderful for Lexington. Opportunities to hopefully draw in more crowds. I believe it's going to bring more people out uh, and want to explore just the uptown area in the depot districts and really help um, uh, just help bring more people into these businesses. A social district in Lexington has been in the works for years. It lets people grab a drink from one location and walk to another. People who have lived there their whole lives, like Wendy Tussie, believe this will only help the city grow. We need to bring in uh, as many possibilities to our town as we can because this town is, it, it's changed a lot in the last 30 years and I want to see it continue to uh, grow and prosper. Social District Cups will have this sticker on them and will allow you to walk within this boundary, sipping as you go. Sophie's Cork and Ale plans to participate. I think more people are just going to come out and feel free to walk around and enjoy a beer, you know, enjoy a beverage um, on, you know, nice weather days and everything, just like the barbecue festival. There's a lot of amazing um, businesses and restaurants and bars and, and like the butcher shop here. I mean, it's just great things that, that people, a lot of people don't know about, but if they come downtown, they may learn. The Lexington Police Department will provide security and enforcement within the social district. The sip and stroll could go into effect this March once cups come in and signs are put up.